Hi, welcome back to UA Technical Solutions. In this tutorial it is explained how to replace oil filter and oil level switch in RC2 series screw compressor. Note, if the compressor is still in the chiller system, be sure to pump down first the system then close the stop valves and release the high pressure inside the compressor before removing or replacing any part for servicing, to prevent any accident at the job site. Dismantle oil filter flange. Step 1. Recover first the lubrication oil of the compressor by loosening the angle valve of the service flange or oil filter flange and drain the lubrication oil. Another way is to loosen all the bolts of oil filter flange and take out the flange to drain the oil. Step 2. After draining all the lubrication oil, loosen all the screw bolts of the oil filter flange and pull out the oil filter flange. Change oil filter. Step 1. Put the oil filter flange in the clamp to fix it. Change oil filter. Step 2. Loosen the oil filter nut using a wrench. Step 3. Take out the oil filter and clean the flange using air or wipe it with a piece of cloth or rag. Change oil filter. Step 4. Put lock tight sealant in the end side screw of oil filter flange. Step 5. Install the new oil filter to oil filter flange and tighten it using a wrench with a torque of 850 kg cm. Assembly oil filter to casing. Step 1. Put oil filters inner, Teflon, and outer gasket to oil filter flange. Assembly oil filter to casing. Step 2. Install oil filter assembly to compressor casing. Step 3. Install all hexagonal screw bolts and tighten it using a hexagonal wrench or torque wrench with a torque value of 1000 kg cm. Oil level switch replacement. Step 1. Use a torque wrench or hexagonal wrench to loosen the bolts of oil switch cover. Step 3. Take out the magnet from the crankcase and clean it using air or piece of cloth. Oil level switch replacement. Step 3. Check the oil switch using a tester by connecting the two lines of the oil switch to test the terminal line. Assembly oil level switch cover to casing. Step 1. Put the magnet back in the crankcase, as close as possible to oil filter. Step 2. Put the new gasket in oil switch cover and install it to compressor casing and put all screw bolts and tighten it using a hexagonal wrench or torque wrench with a torque 1000 kg cm. Thank you for watching. Please do subscribe us at UA Technical Solutions.